the wild halo player in its natural habitat. When left uninterrupted, the wild halo player spends all of its waking hours fighting other creatures. They use projectile and explosive weapons and occasionally will engage in melee combat. It may seem at first that all it is capable of is fighting, but upon closer observation, they can also be heard using their basic language to communicate with each other as well. You probably rock it lot. You probably rock it lot right here, like from Fortnite. Yeah, I'm probably going to take a trip. I'm not going to Halo players can sometimes be observed using camouflage to blend in with their environment in order to attack or flee with stealth. This is part of their fight or flight reaction. Although it can seem apparent that the Halo players do nothing more than fight one another, they have demonstrated some degree of material value. For example, they seem to have a common desire, that being an object that they call the Oddball. Once they obtain the Oddball, they begin to exhibit very different behavior than before. They become more defensive, seemingly caring about nothing more than keeping hold of the oddball for as long as possible. But for this creature, its greatest desire is also its greatest weakness. When one of them is holding the oddball, it loses its ability to use ranged weapons. This white one has found himself stuck between two rocket-wielding players and a wall. The other players are more than happy to take advantage of this position. The Halo players are most commonly seen fighting every man for himself. But in a certain scenario, they will group together in order to fight the ball carrier if they are in an advantageous position and have been holding it for a long time. For example, this one is using the hard light doorway to neutralize its enemy's ranged weapons, giving it the advantage while still holding the odd ball. But right when the orange one thought it had won, the other three attack in unison in order to stop the orange player from holding the ball for too long. Despite their nature, it's not the Halo player's unrelenting firepower that wins the day, but their cooperation, despite being mortal enemies, that finishes the fight. <laughs> 